Giancarlo, Joey just kind of made the comment that you guys try not to get too high or too low or listen to the outside noise at, at this point in time of the season, knowing how important every game is and that you still control your own destiny. But just how difficult is it to not think about those things right now? Um, yeah, you got to acknowledge it and know it's there, but um, it's it's uh, nothing really productive comes from that. So that, that doesn't help us execute on the field. It doesn't help us get the job done. So, um, yeah, uh, we, we need these next two for sure. And, um, yeah, if tonight is over with, we got we got another one in 12 hours or so. You managed to drive one in in that first inning, and then obviously you guys rallied late in the ninth. But overall, it seemed like the offense was stalled a little bit tonight. Just what makes that raise pitching staff so tough, not only tonight, but really throughout the course of the entire season? Um, yeah, they were making good pitches, staying on the corners, um, uh, not leaving too many pitches over the plate. So um, when, when, when you can execute like that, uh, you know, you're going to neutralize a, a good lineup. So, um, you know, the, they'll make mistakes, and uh, we got to capitalize. Tom Merriam, you have the next question. John Carla, you had a couple of adventurous base running uh, in the ninth inning there. Was that also to just get the team inspired uh, for the late rally? Um, well, you saw... Saw an elevated uh, ball to second, so I got to take second, give us, uh, you know, get a, runner, a scoring position, and uh, they were giving me third base, so got got to take that too. But um, yeah, if it if it was to get it, if it got us going a little better, then then that's good, which we were able to get a couple of runs out of it. So um, yeah, just came up short. Bob Clappish, you have the next question. Giancarlo, it's a race this tight, uh, nerve-wracking. Would you say you're enjoying it? Is it fun? Is it thrilling? Or would you try and block all of that out, uh, considering how high the stakes are? Uh, I'm in and out of those uh, those emotions you described there, but I, I'm more um, more just trying to stay focused, trying to be locked in. Um, don't want to be bouncing around. Uh, um, you know we're down, we're up, we're gonna. You know we lost, we're, all this stuff. It's just stay focused, do do what I can do, um, do what I can control um, up there, and yeah, try to help us win. Thanks. Randy Miller, you have the next question. Yeah, John Carlo, uh, you had some big seasons, did a lot of things when you were in Florida all those years, and. Uh, carrying teams been doing it now in new york with the pressure is it a different feeling in in your mind you feel like you're substantiating yourself that you're doing this in new york with pressure some of the same things you did in florida um i uh haven't haven't sat to think about that that those are those are off season um you know evaluations that that I'll do that I'll look back and say I could have done this better or that better but uh, I'm I've got to stay in the zone and try to just um, you know focus on on helping us win each day so uh, we got a lot of work to do and um, takes a lot of mental and physical strain and focus so uh, I'm not worried of I'm not thinking about like personal how good i'm doing pressure no pressure whatever I, I i gotta handle each situation one at a time and um try to get it done brendan cuddy you have the next question john carlo how tough is it to not have dj lemayhew in the lineup uh, especially on a night like tonight with the stakes so high uh, yeah, I mean he's a he's a very tough at bat. He 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 runs. He's the spark of our our lineup um, up top there. So um, yeah, it's tough, but uh, you know it's it's what we got right now, and you know we'll, we'll see how it goes. And have you had a chance to talk to him throughout today? See how he's feeling? Uh, yeah, I have. Um, but uh, I, I'm not going to speak for him. Um, you know, we we'll just keep that in with us.